Welcome to Larry's Library. Back in the unboxing room, and this time this is the haul for March. These are books ordered in February. I'm going to start with the little one here. Now this is something that has been pushed back and pushed back. I've lost count of how many times. I didn't think it was ever going to come out at one point. And I, I, I don't think I have a screenshot of it. If I do, I'll put it up here. But I don't, I don't think I kept it like a dumbass. But at one point, Images website for this listing for the book I'm getting ready to unbox, it, it, uh, it kept changing the date. And then after about the third time, it put the year at uh, 2,999. Now, I don't know if they did that as a gag or if it was just some kind of a placeholder. But either way, I thought it was funny. But anyway, it finally did come out. All of these were ordered from InStockTrades.com, my preferred vendor for graphic novels. No affiliation, but I am completely open to the, to the concept. So, anybody has any power and influence, send them my way. So, InStockTrades, their new cardboard insert is utter perfection. This is how you pack books for shipment. It doesn't get any better than that. And look how it is nestled down in there. Can you see that? The only thing you could say is they're a little hard to get out, but I'm okay with that. You gotta use gravity to help you get them out. Because look, look at that insert. And these are fantastic to keep and use for if you ever sell something. If you ever sell any of your treasures, that's the way to ship it right there. So this is Time 2 Omnibus. Actually, it's Time Squared is what that is how that's said. But it's uh, Howard Chaikin. And, you know, I actually was thinking this was standard size when I ordered it. And I was just going to live with it because I don't have this material. I've never read it. But I'm a big Howard Chaikin fan. But this looks oversized to me. Would you say that's oversized? One second. We'll test that. Uh, yeah, that is oversized. Yeah, I don't know what this is. Somebody sent this to me free in a package of some other things. Unrelated. But anyway, yeah, I'm, I'm even more happy now because it's not only a hardcover of Howard Shake and Goodness I haven't read yet, but it is in fact oversized. And these are still available, I think, at IST. So yeah, it's, I, I really don't know what it's about. It's something to do with time travel, I'm sure, but that's all I know. But written and illustrated by the, I guess I needed that. Written and illustrated by the legendary Howard Chaikin, so I don't think we can go wrong there. So here's the big box. All right, this one doesn't have the insert, but it does have a ton of bubble wrap sheets. Look at that, huh? That is the way to do it. In fact, you can't fling them out because they're so wedged in there. So I'll just take them out one at a time. But you can see they're nestled in there really good. Is that a good shot of that? So here's the first one. This is Captain Action. Now, I find the name completely hokey and, and silly. And I'm not much of a Golden Age guy, but this, uh, I think this is probably more Silver Age, which, not a great Silver Age guy either. But the names attached to this, I couldn't resist. This is Gil Kane, Wally Wood, and Jim Shooter. I mean, I don't see how it can miss. It looks like some silly Silver Age fun, but yeah, it, it wasn't expensive. Introduction by Mark Wade. Um, yeah, I think I'll have a lot of fun with this one. Now this one is standard size. You can see the difference here. <clears throat> now we got a Marvel Omnibus. This is Captain America. What's this one called? The Trial of Captain America. This is with this Omni. I now have all of the Brew Baker caps in Omnibus format. Now, when I switched over from singles to Omnis, I claimed that I was going to sell off the bulk of my single collection to help pay for the cost of all this stuff. And I have all of the singles of Cap's, uh, or uh, rather, of Brubaker's Cap run. So now the question is, now that I have all these in 
in Omnis, am I going to sell all the singles? I'm not sure. <laughs> uh, maybe I sell some of them and I keep a few gems. I don't know. Okay. And the last one in this giant box from IST. Look at all that wrap, huh? Get that out of the way. This is Daredevil Born Again, the Gallery Edition. I love these so much. Gallery Edition is my favorite format. And so this is a double dip for me because I have this in the, um, I believe it's uh, Frank Miller Daredevil, Daredevil by Frank Miller Companion Omnibus. This material's in. So I have already read it, but now we get it in this giant, gorgeous gallery edition format. So I'm happy to add to that. I think I might have to do a gallery edition uh, collection tour. Let me know in the comments if you'd like to see that, because I don't have all of them, but I have a good chunk of them. So that is my haul for this, for the month of March, stuff ordered in February. Look at that. And I'm most excited actually for the Howard Chaikin. Uh, Times squared. See you next time.